Hi everyone and welcome to this tutorial. Um, today's session is going to spotlight Chrome's extension menu. So because Chrome has so many amazing and easy to use extensions, it's easy to get carried away with adding them. But fun fact, the more extensions you have loaded on your toolbar, the slower your computer is going to run. So today I want to show you an easy way how to turn them on and off so that your device is running at optimal speed. So first thing is to open up Chrome and take a look at all the extensions you have loaded and currently running and active anytime you are on a tab. Once you have located all of your extensions, you want to do an assessment. What do you, what do you actually need to be running at all times and what just doesn't need to be? When you make that assessment, you can find this puzzle piece, and this is Chrome's extension menu. When you click that puzzle piece, it's going to bring up your menu where you will have the ability to easily toggle extensions on or off. And so the one that I have right here, um, Screencastify, is one that I don't use all the time. So that's something that I may turn it on you can see it just appeared for me when I want to use it. But then when I'm done, I'm going to go ahead and if, again, watch the screen here. When I click the pin, when I unpin it, the extension is no longer on. It's no longer running and slowing down my device. So again, just take some time to think about what extensions you have loaded, what is needed and what isn't needed. I will say there are some extensions that have been pushed out to you that um, you won't have any control over, but um, for the ones that you have personally added, this is a very important tool to make good use of. And also, um, one last thing while you're in this menu, not only can you turn extensions on and off, but you can go ahead and delete extensions by removing from Chrome. And you can also expand your extensions menu even further to get um, more information if you're curious as to which version of an extension you're running. So I hope you have found this helpful. Thanks for watching.